Hey Church, it's great to see you today. My name's Sarah Roberts. I lead the prayer team at our amazing North location and it's a great privilege to be able to share this devotional with you today. I'm just going to start by reading a very well-known passage which I'm sure you will have heard many times before. It's Philippians 4 verses 4 to 6 and in that verse, those few verses, it says, Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. So this passage here is probably what I would consider to be one of my life verses, one of my main life verses. And it's a passage that God gave to me quite a few years ago now and that he's been speaking to me about in multiple different ways over over several years in the way that only God can do, how he can speak to us about so many different things from the same passage. But the part that I'm particularly wanted to talk about today was where it says, for in everything, by prayer and petition, in every situation, present your request to God. And, and this is something that God's really been speaking to me about recently, because I don't know, for me, certainly, um, I think that I, sometimes I find it easy to pray about the really difficult things in life. So the, the situations where you feel like there's no way out other than if God helps. So I don't know, salvation for a family member or healing or some thorny difficulties with your children. You know, in those situations, it's quite easy to, to, to pray because that's almost a, it's not a default setting, but it's almost the only thing that you can do. But I think for me, what God's really been speaking to me about is is praying about everything. So I think for me, where I can tend to get overwhelmed sometimes in life is the situations, is all the small things, is all the small things where they add up, where things that you don't really think to pray about because you just think maybe, you know, you should be able to resolve them on your own or even that you don't even think they're worth praying for. And I do think that sometimes those are the situations that can build up and really cause stress and really cause anxiety. And in some cases, I think it's just because we're not giving God an opportunity to do what he can do. So, as I say, God's just been really challenging me recently to pray about everything, however big, however small. And I have to say, as I've been doing that, as I've been consciously making a choice to think, what is it that's bothering me today or this hour or this minute? And bringing it before God, he has absolutely blown me away with with his answers to to even what you might consider to be very small prayers. So things like, I mean, recently I had to travel up and down the M6 multiple, multiple times over the course of a few months due to a family member being ill. And every time I set off, I prayed that I wouldn't get stuck in traffic because anybody that knows the M6, you know, that's quite likely. And, you know, in three months of traveling back and forth, all times of the day, I never once got stuck in traffic, never once. And I just thought that was absolutely amazing. Um, I've had multiple answers to small in inverted commas prayers over the past couple of months even over the past week as God's been teaching me to just pray about everything I've had answers to prayer at work I've had global supply chain issues that are causing us a big deal with a customer that's causing me a really difficult and challenging situation they've just miraculously resolved themselves when I've prayed about it I've had um, any issues with relationships at work that I've prayed over have miraculously come right um, I, ca I can't even begin to tell you all of the things. In fact, this morning, I actually really needed an Amazon delivery of a of a plumbing part <laughs> to arrive sooner than it said it was going to because our sink's not working. And I prayed and it turned up this morning, two days earlier than planned. So hopefully we might have a working sink for the weekend. So, um, so yeah, just, I mean, as I say, God has just blown me away with his answers to prayers for even small things like Amazon delivery amazon deliveries arriving sooner so I, I i and it just is such a reminder that he's such a good god and he loves us so much and he wants the best for us that even in these really small and seemingly insignificant situations you know if it's important to us it's important to him so i hope that's encouraged you today i would just encourage you whatever it is that's bothering you whatever it is that's worrying you today take it to god you know he loves to bless us he does supply all of our needs, the big ones and the small ones. So, yeah, I hope to encourage you today. Have a great day. See you soon. Bye.